You don't can be so blind with puzzle artisman that you don't can face reality. We bring nothing good on the table. Only what humans do is taking and taking and taking and taking a little bit more. We totally disregard for other life forms. In hell there is a large road. Just like the ones that have been uh, there to flat the stones on Page Road. This motor is 250 miles long and the beam where it means right it is also the same length long. What well, it stands for the motor with a whip and forces the people to lay on the ground like stones on a path. 200 to 200, 250 people being forced on the beam and they forced to put the roller on the people that lie on the ground. They are being whipped and the people who are being screaming have been crushed and also hung and wailing. Blood flies everywhere. It's gone from morning to night. And then the ones that have been uh, put on the ground been back to put back to life. And be forced to lay again and be crushed to life. And then they're being put in a fire as high as a mountain. I've seen them. Oh, a man how butchers coach, I mean, a man how butchers cattle, and a man how sold the flesh of animals. I have asked him what I have done, and I have eaten it with my own eyes. Mohe Nardin, the legend of the vegan spiritual teacher and Muslim sheikh. All creations have get a place to live. All have created a connection to Aether and to earth. But men take what uh, is common to all. And he claims the, wo the world is his. He claims the water is his. And he claims the animals as his. All be members of the same body. If one brings suffering on one other being. And then I, on one map, the others cannot stay as a rest. You, how, how remain to being indifferent from the suffering? And pain of others don't deserve to be called human. And if the lives remain vegan, Muslim spiritual teacher, awaken humanity. You don't have to uh, be put away from your religion, you only have to take the immoral parts of your religion. And in all the finite and brutal parts. Is it so hard for humans to choose compassion instead of brutal traditions that be based on psychosis? So, it is time for you to stop making, uh, trying to find um, evil parts in your Quran to justify your behavior. And it's time to step into reality! And go vegan. And stop claiming that the whole world belongs to you. And stop claiming that your economic profit be more important than the planet. Your God, Allah, have created the earth and all his inhabitants. So it is time to worship them instead of the root of all evil. Pathetic piece of human trash! There have been a lot of different parts that your masters 
Your puppet masters refuse to let you see. Learn to think for yourself. Was one of the first things that I think uh, people have to learn in this age. Because if you follow some blo somebody blindly, you find out that the people that are doing the oppression and be cruel, that you hate the peaceful and good people, awaken humanity from your so called horrific dreams and learn to think for yourself. As long as you not can do that, as long as you listen to phonies in one puppet master costume that you call presidents and take them serious, you don't deserve to be called human. And you mean a puppet and not a nerd. I have nothing personal to uh, Muslims. I have a um, vendetta against evil traditions that humans protect, that they have in, that uh, they do because. It'd be tradition. Why uh, deny the uh, compassionate parts in your religion and worship the final part in your traditions? If I have the power, I rewrote most of the uh, religion books and make it clearly that their gods don't want to let you harm. One of his creations. And that all living beings being created equal. That I don't deserve to be commodified. Awaken humanity. Don't stay in dogmas. Awaken and open your eyes and look in the world without dogmas. Pathetic piece of human trash. If I have created them, all the humans. I will put my hat in a bag.